good morning welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another vlog in today's vlog we're starting the day with a new coffee recipe we are trying Vietnamese coffee I saw it on TikTok or Reels one of the platforms and it just looked like a really 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 delicious recipe we have about an hour drive well 45 minutes to like an hour drive because we're going to be going to connecticut today to just explore look at some really nice houses just to kind of switch it up i did do my hair last night and i use sultanicals i use the camp believe it's not butter i still have the huge tub and it actually still works really well i just used that because my hair was feeling kind of dry just like my lips i need to put some something on them let me see I had to put something on my lips because they were feeling dry but yeah i use the can't believe it's not butter my hair has been feeling dry so i wanted a thick cream and so this is the only thing that's in my hair right now i did wet plop overnight so I left this in my hair and now I'm just letting it air dry. That's why it looks kind of flat right now, but it's okay because as the day goes on, it's going to be big and you guys will see the transformation. I wanted to do some makeup, but it's a, I don't know, like we don't really have that much time for me to sit here for like 30 minutes and do makeup. So yeah, we're making coffee. So let me show you guys the coffee that we're making. So for coffee today, I use, I already brewed it. I didn't capture that shot because I thought of vlogging after I started my coffee, but I did Bianca Leggero. Here it is. This is what it looks like. It has the beautiful little ombre. And this one I, I got because it pairs really nicely with anything. So I thought it would be really good for that recipe. All right, I made the coffee. Here it is. It looks a little light. I only put oat milk in here and the condensed milk, so I didn't put no syrup. I didn't put any creamers. So let's see. I'm excited. I hope it's good. I feel like it's definitely not bitter, but I feel like I'm not tasting the coffee anymore. Maybe I should have used a stronger pod because I feel like I feel like I should have used a more like stronger pod. Guys, he's ready to be a dad. He put his little, the little water. Oh, I packed the food, the blankets. So sweet. Okay, here. We are in the car now. Here's Mio. Mio's gonna be my little companion because Milo likes to ride. Oh, Milo, you coming over here too? Oh, I feel so special. Mm. Both dogs came to me. Look at me. Mio's already out of breath. Mio. We have about a 45 minute to an hour depending on traffic my hair is already almost dried which is nice i have my kindle you guys i got a kindle and i have not been able to put it down i got it for 54 dollars so stock the amazon website because it's originally a hundred dollars and i was on it and they were like deals of the day and the kindle was one and it was perfect timing because i wanted to read more books like i want to read more often so i got the kindle and i've been reading the book called verity it's called verity by hold on hold on what is her name? Colleen. Colleen. Oh God. Colleen. Right there. So that's the book that I'm reading and it's really good. So I'm going to take advantage and just read more. I'm on chapter like five now. So I'll see you guys when we get there. Also, the Vietnamese drink that I got or I made, I didn't like it. I think I put too much milk and I needed to use a more stronger pot. So I will try it again. Just not with Bianca Leggero because I do not like that combination. Can I please get a grande iced caramel with oat milk? <laughs> a grande iced caramel macchiato? Uh, is, that, is that what it is? No. I'm sorry, no. Grande latte. iced caramel oat milk latte with uh, dark caramel. So you want dark caramel instead of regular caramel yes. syrup? Yes. Yes. Dome and croissant? That's it.
It's a little bit later now, way later. We watched um, some Ozarks, had dinner, and I changed into my PJs, unwind, did like my little night routine. And I got some packages that I wanted to go through with you guys because I ordered something from Target. And I got some really exciting stuff, like techie stuff, mostly from this like new line that I discovered at Target. And I was like, I need to save this unboxing for the vlog because from what I seen online, it looked really, really promising. I have a huge cup of tea here, and this is my new favorite mug. It says Prey from Marshalls, and I am drinking a, a decaffeinated chai latte. They get chai latte, chai um, tea. And I've really been into them, especially at the end of the day. I just bring it out, put my jazz music, fireplace, and I read my Kindle. Literally has been my favorite thing to do, like soothing music and then just the fireplace, the cozy vibes. So I'm definitely missing my book right now, but we're gonna unbox this and then I'm just gonna unwind for the rest of the night and just kind of chillax. But I wanted to show you guys what I got. So chai teas are literally my favorite. Here's the Target box. It is huge. So this is everything that was in the box. And the box was huge for just these things, but let's go through them. By the way, this is all like techie stuff. This is no hair products, no makeup, no skincare, none of that. It's all like techie stuff. Because I discovered a brand is called Heyday, and they have a lot of like nice techie stuff. So I wanted to get some. So I got a laptop charger for my computer. It has the USB-C ports. Because the one that I have only holds one, and this one holds two. And sometimes I want to ch charge my iPad and my laptop at the same time since they're both USB. SBC, so I thought this was perfect for that and of course what sold me was the color oh it's so small this is actually so cute it is so slim and tiny look at it against my hand it seems way smaller than the standard one from Apple and then it has like the little wall adapter here so this is really nice this next item is also for my like workspace it is a USB-C multiple input like adapter because the Mac doesn't have enough slots for all the ports that I use when I'm editing a video. So I got one from the same company. This is all from Heyday, by the way. Wow, it even has a HDMI. It has a HDMI, USB-C, and then it has three regular ones. And then of course, it's this beautiful color and it has that USB-C port for my computers. I have here the desktop, desktop, can't even talk, desktop, how oh, I scratch myself? Desktop microphone, did I need it? no but when i want to do like zoom meetings you can plug this microphone in and the audio quality is better or facetime or just anything that has to do with like audio on your macbook or your iphone like anything you can just connect this to it so hello no brainer for me i'm gonna leave this on the other side of my desk like seriously look how beautiful this microphone is and it comes with a little stand like what this is so freaking cute <laughs> guys like this is so stinking cute now we have what i actually really 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 needed for my computer and this is what i was looking for in target until i stumble upon everything else but this is a sound bar from the same company i usually like edit with my beat headphones on because i like that it has the noise cancellation feature but sometimes like when i'm home by myself and i've been editing with the speakers i'm destroying this package what if i want to return something what if something doesn't work i want to like give my ears a break and just let them breathe <laughs> so i always take off the headphones and since i have my computer on a monitor the audio that comes out from the computer like it's super super low and faint so i've been looking for like a good wow this is huge where am i gonna put this on my desk i did not realize this was so big what the heck includes soundbar six feet optical case six feet aux cord Ooh, and remote battery wow is this like for no in the picture it shows that it's for a tablet this is huge oh my god where the heck am i gonna put this see this is why i need to keep the box because where the heck am i gonna put this this is beautiful though i will say so it goes like this this is the front part and then you can stand your ipad here it shows it on like the picture that you can stand your ipad here wow this seems really nice i just don't know where it would fit on my desk because my desk is pretty packed as it is oh here's all of the wires it comes with a remote which this is me being picky but i'm surprised the remote is not like the same color as this that would be really cute and then the last but not least is something to make tiktoks and like video on and i didn't need this i will say i did not need it didn't need it but the color and just advertisement for it was top notch 
Oh, this is pretty. It's the colors for me. Like, this is so nice. And look, guys, it has the remote control right there. So I don't lose it. I can take my own little pictures. It's just, you know, a tripod. And it actually gets pretty tall. So, you know, I could take some selfies and stuff i'll link all of these products down below by the way in case you see something that you're just like oh that's cute or oh i need that but it comes with a ring light look at the ring light <laughs> i have so many ring lights but this one is kind of cool because it has the phone adapter so i have it over here let me bring it in so you guys could see i'm gonna turn on the light to see how bright it is whoa that's pretty bright okay but well that's actually pretty bright oh here's warm for some like ambiance <laughs> and then there's warm there's cool and there's in between Ooh, okay this is actually pretty nice i'm not gonna lie this is actually pretty nice let's set this up i'm intrigued okay now it's on oh hello hello there my friend hey there soundbar it's connected oh shoot okay what song should i play um what song should i play let's listen to some worship that's not even as loud as it goes I can't return it i cannot return it because i can totally be jamming this is epic okay i don't know why i thought it needed to be connected but now that it's wireless i'm definitely keeping it for some reason i thought i needed to have it connected to one of these situation and i don't like wiring so being that it does it wireless obviously if it pairs to my phone it can pair to my mac and my videos are gonna sound great and not only that my music is gonna sound great everything is gonna sound great and again it comes with hi papa look there's a remote you're the different setting so that's so freaking cool like i could connect it to my tv i could probably connect it to my tv if i need to wait this will be so guys if this doesn't work out for my desk which is a little big and my desk is pretty packed i can totally put this on my tv Oh my God. And it's gonna match the aesthetic for six, was it six, $60? You guys need to get this. This thing sounds so loud. It's the next day and I found the solution for the sound bar. I gotta figure out this situation. It's a lot of wiring situation, but at least it's kind of under control a little bit. And I hide it behind this anyway. But look, I got these little shelves. They're supposed to be like adhesive for the window. And instead of using it for the window, I had an extra one. And so I just drilled it to the wall. And I love that it's acrylic. So from far, it looks like the sound bar is just floating. It works. I'm just gonna staple it to the wall so that it looks straight versus looking all crazy like that. Guys, this sound bar is it. I hit it behind here, but it still sounds really well. And it looks so good. I'm so excited. Oh, so I just finished cleaning up the studio. Perfect. Go. I'm so excited.
gonna be a filming day for me. I am back on my filming game and doing hair videos and stuff like that. So I'm so excited. I'm going to be doing a couple of reels today. I'm going to be doing a hair video. And I actually got new products in the mail. I believe this is from Bounce Curl. So I wanted to open it up with you guys so we can do an unboxing together. And I want to try something new for today's wash and go. So it was perfect timing that I got this in the mail. I, I've been waking up at 5.45 just because that's the time my husband has been getting up for work and I just get up with him and kind of spend the mornings with him. So it's been nice. And then I just get my Peloton workout in, which I did, you guys saw, where I took a shower. And then after that, I made some breakfast. I was reading on my Kindle, which I have been so obsessed with. And then I kind of just hung out and now I am already to film and hang out with you guys today. So I'm so excited. So I was right, it is indeed from Bounce Curl. I have Bounce Curl still on my shelf. I don't use them frequently, to be honest. I used the light cream gel a while ago, and I do remember liking it, I just, I don't know, when I grab a product, when I find a product that I absolutely love, sometimes it's kind of hard for me to like branch out of that. That's why I brought back the product shelf so that I could discover new items. And so today, I was inspired. And so, wow, they sent me an entire thing of products. So we'll just quickly unbox them together. She also has released a lot of newbies. And so I have not been up to date with them. So let's see. We have the Bounce Curl Gentle Clarifying Shampoo. We also have the Super Smooth Cream Conditioner with Organic Aloe and Safflower Oil. Safflower Oil. I already washed my hair, but if I didn't, I would have totally used this. So I'll probably use it next time that I <gasps> they have body products bounce curl fragrance free body cream extra moisture wow look at that okay it seems like it's different packaging the light hold cream gel I still have a bottle over there and the packaging is now different Ooh, this seems exciting I can probably do this on a mask Monday if we can bring those back this is a turmeric hair detox mask with organic apple cider vinegar aloe and charcoal I love apple cider vinegar on the hair it smells not the best but it works really well to like reset your hair and make those curls pop and just extra define I love that Ooh, we have a deep conditioner we I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm not even going to try. But here's the deep conditioner. If you can pronounce that, by all means, do it for me. Because <laughs> I'm not even going to try. I used to like their cream, which I don't think I have any. Oh, <gasps> they restocked me. Oh, I don't think I have this one, actually. It looks like this, but I don't know if it's the same. This is the Avocado and Rose Clump and Define Cream, and it gives you medium moisture. <gasps> I kind of want to try it. I'm so excited. And then we have one more thing. What is this? <gasps> we have an oil. What? I love oils. Okay, but this is so pretty. This is so stinking cute. I will definitely be using this. We might even leave it out so that I can always grab it. Thank you so much to Bounce Girl. We have so many new goodies, so I'm gonna be trying something out today. I can only use the Light Hold Cream Gel or the clump and define cream which i kind of want to try this one i don't remember if it's the same one as but i don't know do i want to try it with a gel from a different brand i don't know i gotta figure out what i want to do i'm definitely gonna try the cream and the oil so i'm gonna go ahead i'm gonna film a video it's gonna be a cocktail video so i'm gonna just try out new products and see how they work in my hair so you guys will see me once i'm all done and then we can proceed to whatever else i'm gonna be doing for the rest of the day i just finished filming the first half of my video and right now my hair is in a t-shirt because i am currently wet plopping my hair i'm gonna have some lunch right now it's three o'clock i took a little break to clean out my closet room which i'll show you guys in a second but i just made a salad i have spinach goat cheese cucumbers hazelnut and some olives just keeping it super duper simple today and i'm gonna have my salad and then i'm gonna go diffuse my hair and then i'll show you guys the room i also got some packages that came in that i want to show you guys and unbox together 
and then we will film the other part of the video and then probably another video so i just finished filming two videos and i have two more to go so i'm gonna do that but i quickly wanted to take an unboxing break you know and show you guys what came in the mail i think i'm still waiting for something else to come from amazon let me see if it's delivered just yet because it's kind of fun we'll skip that but <laughs> we got some pods from Nespresso because I ran out of my favorite pod, which is actually new. I don't know if you if I've ever told you guys what my like current favorite pod is from Nespresso. And I've been using the Essenza Mini more because I really enjoy the lattes. So I got a few pods. We're gonna do a little unboxing and haul. Not like I needed more pods, but I didn't have any more of this one. So this one is actually new. It was launched. On the original line maybe like a month ago and i bought one because i wasn't sure if i was gonna like it and i freaking love it <laughs> i've been doing it iced it's really good so this is the peru organic one and again this is for the the mini machine original line and i love it so much i got two how many did i get because these no i think i got two the first time because i do double espressos on the little machine so that uses two pods and each pod comes with 10 sleeves so this is equivalent to five lattes for me because i use two of them and it comes with 10 like i just said so i got one two three and my husband has been drinking coffee too so i got three of them and then I also got it from the Virtual line, which I don't think I ever had it for the Virtual. And it is also a, is it a double espresso? I don't know if it's a double espresso or just a regular one. I think it's a regular. Yeah, it's an espresso, so it's a regular one. And this is what it looks like. It's the green one. I don't think I've ever tried it from Virtual. I know the green one that I have is Mexico. All right, so I got two of these for the Virtual line just in case it tasted different or I don't know. I just wanted it because I really, really, really have been loving Peru. It's so good with some oat milk and a little bit of ca uh, caramel creamer. Chef's kiss, delicious. And then there's a new launch. Is this a new launch? Yes, there was a new launch and I was intrigued. I was like, hmm, there's actually a few new launches. There's a lemon one, but that one did not call my attention at all. I was like, lemon and coffee, ew. Like what? No. So that one didn't call my attention. However, the coconut one did, which is interesting. But this one is coconut flavor over ice. It's pretty bright. You probably won't be able to see the like fine details, but it's from the barista creation line. I only got one because I don't know how that would taste. I'm not having another cup of coffee today, so we will save this for another vlog. So that was my little Nespresso haul. We could do a little coffee cart restock. Ooh, the sun just went away. I got an exciting order from Shein. So as you guys know, I have been doing press-on nails, or I don't know if I've shared it here, but I've been doing press-on nails, and at first I was doing Gel X. I always like to switch it. Like, for me, I always like to keep it fun, interesting, but I really have been enjoying the Gel X method. The only downside for Gel X is that you gotta paint your nails after, do a design if you want to, and although sometimes I do enjoy doing that when I have a little bit more time, on days where I want, like, a quick manicure and I want something faster, I have been doing the gel x method on press-ons i want to redo my nails today i don't I mean these are like what two and a half weeks in and they still look good they're probably a little dirty but they still look pretty good but i just got a whole bunch of nails so it's only right i might be doing my nails with you guys and i have so many cute oh wait i got something else what is this oh this is for my air fryer for my air fryer i think i got like those baking sheets but it's specifically for the air fryer so when i cook yes okay yeah, so these are just like baking sheets for the air fryer so that when I cook, I can just like put it on the sheet instead. And then I think officially the rest is nail stuff. Oh, <laughs> I got this. It says, let me see if the camera can focus on it. You can't read the whole thing, but it says, shut up, you look good. And I bought this specifically for myself to put it in my bathroom because I always complain about how I look or like, oh, I have like a line here, oh, I have this. So I'm gonna tell myself, girl, shut up, you look good. So I saw this on sheet and I was like, this is perfect. I need this for my bathroom mirror. Just a little reminder, you know? So officially, officially, these are all nails. And I got most of them long. That's what I did with these. These were extremely long, cut them down, shaped them to almond, and I love them. This one is actually calling my attention 
let me lower the brightness look how beautiful we might be doing some blue nails today oh I'm excited I'm excited we're definitely doing these nails today I'm gonna say bye bye to these have them for like two weeks already but there's so many nice ones like look at this one okay I'm gonna take the camera and show you guys this way because y'all not gonna see it with the light yay now I can show you guys look at the blue one here's the blue one tell me it's not good it is extremely long but of course I'm gonna cut them and shape them and I'll just show you guys some designs because obviously I went crazy this is a short one I got it because I thought it was fun and cute all oh, these are the ones that I have on by the way they look kind of dusty and crusty and look just a little bit because them for two weeks love French French is like my favorite so I got pretty much all the Frenchies I could see oh this one's so beautiful too <gasps> look how pretty oh my god that might be between these two we might have you guys pick over on instagram look at this one. Oh my god so beautiful so pretty look at this one ah, that one's pretty that one might not even need much shaping look at this one look at this one this one's more like fall beautiful oh my goodness look at this one like are you kidding me are you kidding me guys these were less than two dollars a dollar and change some of them are two some of them are a dollar and change super duper affordable look at this one oh, i'm living beautiful gorgeous 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 let's see another one mm, look at this one this one matches my shirts that one's so beautiful look at the red look at this one the pastel colors I said I wasn't gonna show you guys all of them but they're just all so beautiful might as well just go through all of them look at this one I have a thing for florals by the way if you can't tell for spring I love it I, since I can't draw it myself I was like I might as well just get some look at this one how fun super fun okay guys we're almost done and then look at the French classic white French and almond shape oh! beautiful what else what else oh my god this one was my favorite this is the first one that i added to my car and i don't even think i need to do much shaping to this one because it's so pretty <sighs> my gosh i got another one of the green look how pretty this one is the french with the little pearls oh my god oh my god oh my god so cute so cute look at this dude this one is beautiful <gasps> and it's already almond for me so i don't have to do too much shaping <laughs> This one's fun too. Festival season or something. I don't know. And then what is this one? This one came. Oh, this one's. And then here's this one. This one, this base color looks a little too cheapy cheapy for me. So we'll see how I could finesse it and make it work. But I'm so excited. I got too excited, guys. So instead of doing my next re video, I'm going to do my nails first and see how much time I have. And then maybe I can film another video. But we'll see. Maybe this can be my video because I can do a reels on this and show you guys in the vlog kind of like time lapse how I do it. But it's between these two nails and I'm going to have to do a poll on Instagram to see which design I should do. I am so freaking excited. <laughs> so excited. 